your headphones stop working on Windows 10, there can be several reasons for the problem, ranging from the headphones themselves to driver issues in Windows or simply settings that haven't been set up properly. Hi, this is Phil from Make Tech Easier, and here we're going to offer you several fixes for headphones not working in Windows 10. Setting up sound devices on Windows can be a messy business. Drivers can clash with each other, Windows might misread one kind of sound output as another, and you may have to dive into your sound settings to figure out exactly what's going on. Of course, all going well, you should be able to plug a sound device in and have it just work. But if that doesn't happen, this guide is here to swoop in and save you. Make sure headphones are set as enabled and set as default device. The other crucial place where you may need to make some changes to get your headphones working is in the sound window. The best way to get here is to right click the speaker icon in the notification area in the corner of Windows, then click Sound Settings. In the Sound Settings window, click Manage Sound Devices to see whether your headset or headphones are under the disabled list. If they are, click them and click Enable. To set your headphones as your default audio device, switching to them automatically as soon as they're plugged in, go back to the Sound Settings menu. Here, click the Choose Your Output Device drop-down and select your headphones from the list. In the future, you'll also be able to change your default sound device by simply clicking the speaker icon in the taskbar notification area and selecting your preferred audio device from there. Update, reinstall or replace sound drivers. If you plug your headphones into your Windows 10 PC and get that reassuring ding sound, the good news is that they're being detected at a hardware level. The bad news is that something's going wrong at the software end in delivering the sound from PC to headphones. To fix this, go to Device Manager, Sound, Video and Game Controllers, and then select your audio driver. In this case, it's Realtek High Definition Audio. Start by right-clicking the driver, selecting Update Driver, and then search automatically for Updated Driver Software. That failing, Right-click the driver, then disable device before re-enabling it again. Finally, you can also try rolling back the driver by selecting properties from the driver's right-click menu, then clicking the driver tab and roll back driver. Change the default format of your headphones. In the sound window still, click the playback tab. Right-click your headphones. They may appear as speakers if plugged in or as a second audio output or similar. Then click Properties and the Advanced tab. Try playing around with the default format of the headphones, clicking Test each time you change it to see if you start hearing audio. Choose HD Audio over AC97. AC97 and HD Audio are two audio standards that generally connect to the front 3.5mm jack port on a plenty of desktop computers. Whether your PC uses one or the other will ultimately depend on which header connects to the motherboard to your front sound ports. Assuming everything is correctly hooked up on the inside, i.e. using more recent HD audio header which detects devices automatically, you should go into your audio driver tool and ensure that your connector settings are correct. Our audio driver tool is Realtek HD Audio Manager, found in the control panel. Open it, click the settings cog in the top right corner and ensure under connector settings that HD Audio front panel is selected. While you're here, you can also use headphones as a second audio device instead of replacing your speakers by ticking the box highlighted in red. So, that wraps it up. Sound can be an awkward issue to troubleshoot, with many different problems spawning many different solutions. Hopefully, you'll find what you need above. If not, leave a comment below and we'll try to help you out. Okay, as always, thanks for watching. That's all for now. See you next time.